overall my happiness is probably like 300% more happiness <laughs> than usual just having my pets. Hey, I'm Roy from Guava Juice and this is my pet tail. So right now I have three dogs. They're all terrier mixes. Callie, she was our first one. Uh, we adopted her at PetSmart and that, that was already her name. She already knew it. Like, it, it just didn't make sense to change it. And Ugi, his, his name was Falala originally. And I was like, what? It was Falala. So we had to change that. And Ugi is like a character from like my favorite cartoon show. And then Izzy, I don't I, I, we we called her like different names for like three days. And Izzy was the only one that stuck. We called her like, no name, hey default, or like, What's up, girl? <laughs> but Izzy stuck with her and she just kept looking at us whenever I said Izzy. Callie, the oldest, um, she is very, she's timid, but she, she gets, it's weird, she, she gets hyper at like 10 a.m. Like she just wakes up at 10 a.m. She just starts running around like, yo, I'm trying to sleep. Chill, calm down. And then Oogie, uh, the middle child, is friendly. He likes sitting on people's laps. He likes sleeping, like he, he loves sleeping on his back like that. Like that. It's, it's kind of crazy, like you would walk towards him and he just slowly flops over like this, like pet me. <laughs> it's very cute. And Izzy, uh, got her like a couple of weeks ago, so we're still learning, but right now she's super sweet, super hyper. She loves chasing her tail, it's weird. And she likes fetching things. She, she, she acts more like a dog than the other two, which is great. It's great having a real dog. <laughs> Callie, the eldest one, she likes being by herself. She's very independent. So whenever I put her on set, she kind of just leaves automatically. But Oogie, he loves the attention. When I put him on like the table, he usually sits down and just like smiles. Sometimes he flops over like he usually does. Like, hey, I'm Oogie. I'm a star. <laughs> he loves the camera. He loves attention. He loves people. So there's this one video where I just fed them potato chips for like an entire 10 minutes. And then we just, we basically just put the microphone as close to their mouths as possible. And all you could hear throughout the entire video is just them crunching on the potato chips and them like, like licking their mouths. It's like the cutest thing ever. So if you've never done that with your pets, try it out. It's amazing. They're probably like, thank you so much if they were, if they could speak. If I could talk to my dogs right now, I would be like, how's my cooking, y'all? Or like, what do you think of me? Like, what do you actually think of me? I know you're sweet, but what do you think? Like. Like, oh, daddy, you're nice, but you fart a lot. <laughs> my pets are my life. <laughs> like, without them, I feel like I wouldn't be as cheerful. Something about going home and seeing their, like, lovely faces, it just makes me smile, it just comforts me, and it just takes every stress away. If I'm having a really difficult day, just petting them alone just relieves everything. They're just always there for you. They love you regardless of where you are or what you're doing. They're just always there for you. So ugh, I miss them so much, like talking about them. They're like, they're back in LA. I'm here in New York. I love you if you're watching this. I love you, puppies. <laughs>